role in government is to act as champion and cheerleader and campaigner for technical education. And that's what you do. And the goal is to equip our country for future economic success and to give all young people the chance to reach their potential. And these are the goals of, of EDGE too. Well, the EDGE Foundation exists to champion technical, practical and vocational learning. And we do that through things like research, policy work, supporting vocational success. But we also support new initiatives. We've given a lot of support to UTCs, university technical colleges, studio schools. And now we're looking at the potential of career colleges to also contribute to raising the status of technical, practical and vocational learning. A career college is a 14 to 19 specialist education uh, provision and it's provision that is led by industry, by employers and would be based in a region where there has been an identified opportunity for young people to uh, gain employment in that sector. What we need in this country are better skilled workforce, particularly our young people more appropriate skills for the workplace and I think career colleges offer one of the solutions to this. Practical technical learning needs a voice. It needs a voice that has access to all stakeholder groups, young people primarily, but their parents, politicians and the wide group of providers. A voice that champions it as having parity with other types of learning. What's important to the AOC is for colleges to have a range of ways in which they can serve their communities better and the young people within those communities. Colleges were given the freedom to recruit directly at 14. There are a number of ways they might do that, but Career Colleges offers them a particularly strong way of doing it, a branded offer, with actually a curriculum and support in order to move into this new area and to actually have the ability to offer a vocational route forward for young people from 14, not just from 16. We are coming at this from where are the opportunities for young people to be inspired and to thrive either in employment or self-employment. The Career College movement is also supported by the three major examining boards, City and Gills, uh, AOC and Pearson. That's very important to get solid organisations that, like that behind that because they will have a critical role in the reshaping, I think, of vocational qualifications as a result of career colleges.